The say whale attracted onlookers on this beach at Sandbridge. A big whale on the beach. It just, it was amazing. Never seen anything like it. Nearly the whole crew of the Virginia Aquarium Stranding Response Team was on the scene Monday. We have moved the whale up above the high tide line and now we did a set of external measurements and external exams, descriptions of any wounds that we see. The other part of the necropsy is the internal exam. And then we'll look for things like stomach contents and parasites and just to learn both about the whale itself and about what might have caused its death. This whale was spotted Saturday five miles off 30th Street along the Virginia Beach ocean front. It washed up here Sunday. This say whale is a filter feeder. Just like a humpback or a blue whale or a fin whale, this one is a member of the baleen whale family. They are usually found far off the coastline where they feed in deeper waters. And this whale is not um, natural to these waters, I'm told. It's way out of its element. Response team coordinator Sue Barco said they don't like to speculate before the necropsy is over. But she added there are some external signs around the head area that may point to the main cause of death. There are some marks on the animal that are consistent with being carried on by a ship, on the bow of a ship. So what we're doing now is focusing on whether those marks happened before or after the animal died.